Amen. 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 Amen.
is the owner of Today's Christian Magazine. He come on the television in the local town on Channel 23 on Wednesday and Sunday night at 11 o'clock. And we down at the radio station faithful every Monday and Tuesday morning. And he down there from Monday to, Monday to 6 to 10, 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. And, and on Tuesday, I'm down there with him from 6 to 8. Glory to God, but he's faithful in what he do. That's what I'm talking about. And that's what God is looking for. Oh, he's thinking, he's thinking about your talent, because your talent don't mean nothing to him. He want to know you're going to be faithful. He wants some faithful folks, amen. And he's faithful to the call. And I don't know what God's going to do. But I do know there's a word of the Lord from him today. I know that God got something down in his belly. And if you will get with the man of God, if you will push him, come on somebody. If you will push him, he won't stay long. Come on somebody. If you will push him, he won't stay long. But he going to come on this afternoon. And he going to give us what thus said the Lord. Amen. I present to you, not only the apostle Michael Adam, but the Holy Ghost. It's going to be one to introduce him. Because I can't introduce him like the Holy Ghost can. But I present to the church, apostle Michael Adam. Church, apostle Michael Adam. Apostle Michael Adam, the church. Give us what God has given you. And said to ourselves, let us receive the word of the Lord. And after receiving the word, let us be changed. And let us be a doer of the word. Preach, Pastor Mike Adam. All right. Hallelujah. Thank you. I made, a, I made a promise to my little man. Thank you, Jesus. Donovan, come on up and pray for me. Oh, glory, See, glory, thank glory, you, glory, Jesus. glory. My little man right here. Thank you, thank you God. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father. Thank you for Pastor Michael and we cover him under the blood and lead him into your way, God. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Amen. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes. Yes. Amen. God. Yes. Yes. Mama, bless your mama. My sister Tiffany, my mom, my wife's armor bearer. That's her. That's her baby boy. Her other boy is my armor bearer. Santa, meet me. Meet, meet Bob, Santa. <laughs> bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Of course, we thank God for all of you, and of course, thank God for Shawanda who come with us today. Okay. If we had time, we would let her do, a, do that, perform that dance ministry she got. It's so anointed. Lord, allow us to come back, and if, if we don't, for her time, you look on TV because you're going to see her. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank God for the McDuffies. Oh, yeah. that's the All right. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Some, some people, some people just just touch your spirit when you see them come in the building. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I'm really, I'm really admonished in the Lord today. Today, today we are, we are moving by the Spirit. We'll get this out the way. <laughs> Thank God for the church family here. Power time ministry. Amen. 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 Pastor Wells told y'all how long ago she know me now, you know. When she was in Greenville, that's her daughter right there. How you know, baby? God bless you. God bless you. Oh, right. You think I remember you, did you? <laughs> <laughs> so happy you look just like your mama, y'all. You know, my, my. She was a little bitty thing, too, back in the You stay right with mama. That's all right. Amen. 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 Give her a hand for being out there doing it with all the other kind of stuff. I <laughs> but uh, praise God, we, we don't have to go through a whole lot of preliminaries because we are we are in a place where it's, it's not a whole bunch of formalities going on. We 
you know, we just come to do the word of the Lord. Amen? Amen. 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 I want you to put your hands together for the angel of this church, Pastor Well. Amen. Amen. I was saying, get that right. <laughs> Come back a second time, one time, bro. Amen. <laughs> yeah, of course, my wife already told you about my mama here. That's my mama. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, uh, I tell you, she, it just came to my mind. I'm going to tell her on your mama. Thank you, Jesus. When she was in New York and I went to stay with her for a minute, right? I was still running around. And one day I came in the house, it was nighttime. Boy, the anointing got on her. She said, Boy, I've been praying for you. I'm a grown man. I ran and fell out on my knees in the morning. I showed you, boy. I tell you, I tell you. That thing stirred my spirit. Mama got some metal there. She said, Woo. My, my, my. I tell you, we just so thankful today. I can tell you a whole lot of stories, but I'm not going to do that. We're going to get in and get out of the way. Um, is that all right? Yeah. Take your time. Take your time. Right. Take your time. Right. Take your time. Right. Praise the Lord. Well, I tell you, um, I happened to call Pastor Wells one evening because she crossed my mind, you know. And during the conversation, she asked me to come to be one of the speakers of this series you have. Of course, you know, I was glad to be able to come and fellowship mm -hmm. with the one of God because I admire her very much. Mm -hmm. I had to write this down so I wasn't forget what I'm saying. <laughs> I, I remember how she prayed for me while she was in Greenville. Oh, she used to look over there at me, oh, just like she was my real mama. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus, I'm I just, just like, I just go. tell you, boy. <laughs> and, 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 just, she just always stayed in my spirit. So I was so glad to be able to see her after some 20 some years. Amen. Yeah. yeah, so if nothing else to see that the prayers of the righteous are very much. Amen. Yeah. Amen. You know, and she was one that prayed for me. I, I look forward to this. Amen. But, but then when I looked at the subject, the spirit moved in me differently than times before when I prepared messages. Do you know? Amen. Amen. I began to see in my study. The comparison of this church, that Tyra, and America today. All right. Amen. All right. All right. Amen. We, we are finding ourselves in Revelation yes, chapter 2, starting at verse 18. Amen. Amen. All right. Revelation chapter Thank 2, you. starting at verse 18. Thank you, Lord. Read as follows. And unto the angel of the church in Thyatira write, These things said the Son of God, who has his eyes like unto a flame of fire, and his feet are like fine brass. I know thy works, and charity, and service, and faith, and thy patience, and thy works, and the last, to be more than the first. Uh -huh. uh, notwithstanding, I have a few things against thee, because thou sufferest that woman Jezebel, which calleth herself a prophetess, to teach and to seduce my servants to commit fornication, and to eat things sacrificed unto idols. And I gave her space to repent for her fornication, and she repented not. Behold, I will cast her into a bed, and them that commit adultery with her into great tribulation, except they repent of their deeds. And I will kill her children with death. And all the churches shall know that I am he which searcheth the reins and hearts, and I will give unto every one of you according to your works. But unto you I say, and to the rest in Thyatira, as many as have not this doctrine, and which have not known the depths of Satan, as they speak, I will put upon you none of the burden. But that which ye have already, hold fast 
till I come. Amen. Watch out now. And he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end, mm. to him will I give power to the nations. Mm. And he shall rule them with a rod of iron. Mm. Mm. And as the vessels of a potter shall they be broken to shivers, even as I received of my father. Mm -hmm. And I will give him the morning star. Mm. He that hath an ear. Let him hear what the Spirit yes. said unto the churches. Yes. Amen. Amen. First of all, the churches do like this church. 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 That, that's what he's talking to y'all. Mm. He's talking to the brick mortar and all these things. He's talking to the church. Amen. We are the church. Amen. Amen. Y'all already know. I don't have to take no Bible lesson on that. You get taught well here. You know? Amen. Yeah. Now, now, now as I was going through, this topic sprang forth in my ears. The compromising church. The compromising church. The setting we find ourselves in is a place called Thyatira. Thyatira was a wealthy town in the northern part of Lydia of the Roman province of Asia. The place was regarded as a holy city. For there stood the temple of the ancient Lydian sun god, Tamos. Another temple at Thyatira was dedicated to Sambiti, and at this shrine was a prophetess. Mm -hmm. By some supposed to represent Jezebel. Mm -hmm. Thinking that she was representing Jezebel. Mm -hmm. But Thyatira was specially noted for the trade guilds which were probably more completely organized there than any other ancient city. Every craftsman belonged to a guild, and a guild is like our labor unions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And every guild, which was incorporated, organization possessed property in its own name. It made contracts for great constructions and wielded a wide influence. Powerful among, among them was the Guild of Coppersmiths. They dealt from copper. Mm -hmm. Another was the Guild or the Labor Union for the Dyers. Mm -hmm. Who it is believed made use of this instead of shellfish mm -hmm. for making purple dye. Mm -hmm. You know who we're talking about? Mm -hmm. A member of this guild seems to have been Lydia mm -hmm. of Thyatira. Mm -hmm. She was recorded in the Book of Acts. Mm -hmm. You remember young lady Lydia? She dealt in purple. Mm -hmm. Wasn't poor now. This was expensive. This, this woman came with money mm -hmm. to help the cause of Christ. So she sold her dyes in Philippi. Christianity reached there at an early time. It was taught by many of the early church that no Christian might belong to one of these labor unions. And thus came the greatest opposition to Christianity. Yeah. This brings the opportunity to stand for Christ mm -hmm. or compromise. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. What, what do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> well, in order to belong to these labor unions, mm -hmm. would mean you have to attend these lavish feasts. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Partying? With the rich and famous. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's what you would be doing. <laughs> you know how we get dressed up you know, and go and meet everybody. And, yeah. You know, we love getting dressed up, right? Right? Yeah. But when you went to these parties, these were business parties. Uh -huh. Before the regular kind of party. You, know? uh -huh. so you went there to meet people and rub elbows. Uh -huh. So you can get more money. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, this caused an opportunity for compromise. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In order to belong to this guild, you had to party with them. And at these meetings, mm, they were devoted to licentiousness. You know what that is? Oh it was getting nasty. nasty. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. This was connected to the worship of the erotic idols of the Greek world. Uh -huh. That's right. This is how they persuaded men to do business. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Jesus. They would have prostitutes there, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. And if they wanted your business, right. yeah. they would send you one of the prostitutes to convince right. you uh -huh. to join them. Mm -hmm. Sound like America, though. Sound like America. Yes. 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 I mean, 
we, we find that, look, how many times have we heard about people in Washington, D.C. Go ahead, Pastor. Who've been caught up <laughs> with the knock on the door at the hotel room. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Same thing, same thing. Uh -huh. Amen. Yeah. Time. My, my, my. Thank you, Jesus. This was the problem that the third time Christian faced. Uh-huh. Because in order to make a living, they had to belong to a union. Mm -hmm. But to attend the union was to become involved mm -hmm. or to be sorely pressed to become involved mm -hmm. with the worship of idols and all this licentious debauchery. Mm -hmm. So they had to make a choice. Mm -hmm. It was difficult to live in their attire as a Christian for this reason. Mm -hmm. But apparently Jezebel had begun to teach that it was all right for them to go along with some of these requirements. Uh -huh. you know? mm -hmm. That they need to submit to these pressures in order to make a living. Uh -huh. You know, so you got to live, baby. No, you ain't got to look. You ain't got to look. You go to the party. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You, you, you got to drink that wine. Okay? Go ahead. Go ahead. Come on, hang out. Go ahead. Uh -huh. Man, I, you know, My Lord Jesus. God understand. You know, you need God understand, baby. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, Pop. Look, you, you come on. You got to come to the party. You know you're going to get a raise if you come to the party now. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So. What happened? What happened? The compromising church. Yes. Yes. Go ahead, compromise because we Jesus. think without that money mm -hmm. we can't make it. Go ahead, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. This whole scenario is paralyzed in many churches today yes. mm -hmm. that accept the easygoing sexuality, mm -hmm. lack of standards mm -hmm. that is so widespread in our society ahead, today. Uh -huh. You know I'm telling the truth. Yeah. Yeah. For instance, we'll make a plan. For instance, some churches <clears throat> approve of homosexuality uh -huh. as an alternative lifestyle. Go ahead, Apostle. Church! Bring it on. Bring it on. Now, 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 yeah. let, me, let me tell you, we believe that everybody has a free week. Mm -hmm. That's right. We believe that you can be in bondage to something. Mm -hmm. And that's what we look at. You, you, you are homosexual because you are bonded to your flesh. Yes. Uh -huh. We're right. going to pray for you mm -hmm. it, so that you can be delivered. That's it, Apostle. Yes. Yes. We ain't going to kick you out. Stay here. Stay right here. Mm -hmm. But don't you try walking my pulpit. My God. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Say something, there. <laughs> you better go ahead. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's just here. I ain't talking about the compromising church. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we got compromising churches, huh? Yeah. Huh? Wrist so bent that you can't even hold them straight. Mm. And they have to say, Lord, the Lord say. Ha ha. Yeah. Lord. Yeah, that's right. Uh, 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 jumping up, dancing, and sweating, and pressing yeah. iron all over the place. Mm -hmm. As soon as they leave, they're looking at the boy on the organ. Oh, oh, nice yeah. My God, my God. Oh, nice nice. Nice. Yes. <laughs> He's trying to pick out the nicest usher. He looks so good standing back there. Oh, oh, thank you, Lord God. God. Amen. 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 In the church. That's it. That's it. Oh, see, see. That now. People, people don't. Right. They don't want you to talk about that. Mm. Go ahead, Apostle. They want to say, it's all right. That's my pastor. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Pastor, see what they're saying in the church. Yeah. All right. All right now. You better go ahead. I'm telling you what's on my note. Amen. <laughs> Amen. 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 When, when, the, when the lady came and told me and my wife one evening, we was counseling about this guy. He was a preacher. He said he's an apostle. Lord have mercy. And he solicited her. He said, the Lord told me to tell you. It's all right for us to go ahead and do this because I don't want to go out there and. Mm -hmm. Lord Jesus. Yeah, baby. They do. My Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. They preach real hard and you get all excited. Yes. Yeah, 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 man, Pastor. I said, well, maybe I'll let him in because I don't want him to get in trouble. Mm -hmm. You compromise, huh? Amen. That's right, Pastor. Don't you do that? I had to bring her home because you asked me to come here now. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Come on, all right. It's it's all right. right. We, we, we don't want you to compromise. Right. No. No. Compromise will take you to hell. Mm -hmm. yes, it yes, it will. yes, it will. Yes, it will. Mm -hmm. Well, well, we find that going on <laughs> in, in the church today. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. But the Lord mm -hmm. holds the church responsible. Yes, he does. Yes. Yes. See, many, many. Leaders do not discipline their members All right. 
when they fall into sexual immorality. Go ahead and bring that up. Yeah, he, he, he's a deacon, you know, I can't say that to him because he, you know.